Hello, it's me, Scott, uh, Mr. Allsop History .com. I just want to share with you the quickest and easiest way to record a screen capture without installing any extra software, assuming that you are using Windows 10. Um, it's Windows key plus G. Uh, that's it. Uh, watch what happens. I've got a PowerPoint on the screen here. I'm going to hit Windows key and G. And uh, it's going to say, do you want to open Game Bar? Um, that sounds a lot of fun. So I'm going to say, yes, this is a game, um, even though it isn't. But uh, but it's going to say that it is. And then it's going to open this little thing. This is designed for gamers. This is meant to be so that you can uh, screencast what you're doing on a game. But it's a computer. It doesn't realize that your PowerPoint that you're going to talk through for your kids is not a game. It's very serious history. Um, and all you need to do now that this game bar is loaded is, first of all, make sure that your microphone is enabled, presuming that you're going to talk through it, and then hit record. Um, off we go. You can see up here, I am now recording uh, a screen capture of this. And uh, if I hit the space bar, it's going to go through into the next slide of uh, my PowerPoint. Uh, I'm working on the inquiry question, by the way. Um, but that, you know, it, it goes through and you can just run the PowerPoint as normal. And then once you're done, you're going to hit stop. And it's then even going to tell you where that file has gone. Game clip recorded. All right. Thank you very much, uh, Microsoft. I'll clip on there. And oh, it wants to take me to an Xbox console companion. Well, I'm not going to worry about that. I'm just going to close the whole thing down and not worry about it at all because actually what i need to do in order to find that file is uh to go into uh this pc videos captures and there it is okay it's sitting right there okay uh, there's actually a demo one that i just did that's the one this is the one that i just did uh, off we go you there. can see up here i am now recording uh, a screen capture of this and uh, if I hit the space bar it's going to go a little bit uh, weird there and, and sort of Inception-esque because I'm playing back a video on a video but that's it and that file you can then very very easily just upload straight to, straight to, uh, straight to your hosting service or bung it on YouTube or whatever. Incidentally if you have particularly slow internet like I do, then you might want to run it through something called Handbrake, first of all, in order to shrink that file down. Handbrake is free software. You can go to handbrake.fr. Um, handbrake fr uh, and you can download this software. Basically, what it does is it will convert um, video files it's a transcoder it will convert it into a different format and make it a little bit smaller i've got handbrake sitting here uh, on my computer i might as well show you how it works uh so handbrake is loading at the moment or at least it should be there we go and look it even it's its logo is like a little cocktail um i'm going to drop the file drag and drop the file that i just made look it's 30 megabytes it's quite big um and I'm just going to save it out. I'm going to choose a preset. And the preset that I am going to choose, uh, just for me, I'm going to call it Fast 720p. Uh, this is a nice balance between quality and size. Uh, I've got my save location now, and I'm just going to start that encode. It's going to quickly go through. It's going to effectively shrink the size of that video file down. Um, which is going to make it much, much easier for me to upload um, onto YouTube or wherever. Now, the reason that it's taking a while to sort this at the moment is because I'm also recording another screencast in a different piece of software in order to explain how I'm doing all this. But once that thing is done, it will save out to the location that you have told it to do. It will be much, much smaller than the original file, but it won't be noticeably different in quality. It won't be a noticeably lower quality video. Um, I'll show you that again in a minute. For the time being, I'm just going to remind you 
the easiest, quickest way to record, sorry about that, a screen capture without installing any extra software. Let's just put that on silent. Um, is just to use Windows, hold down the Windows key and G uh, on a Windows 10 computer, and uh, then you can you can just record. Uh, just don't forget to unmute the microphone so that you can talk over it. If you find that the file is too big, download the freely available, definitely no malware, uh, video transcoder Handbrake from handbrake.fr. And once that is there, and once it is encoded, it has finished. I know that it's sitting here in my videos. There it is. That video that was 30 megabytes has now shrunk down to 726 kilobytes. It's less than one megabyte. And as you, you can, can see, see up here, I am now recording uh, a screen capture of this. Uh, no noticeable loss in quality, but it's a lot smaller and it's going to be a lot quicker for me to be able to upload that onto YouTube or my uh, hosting platform for, for whatever I'm using for remote teaching at the moment. So if you want to talk through something, this is a way that you can do it. It's quick. It's easy. We've all got uh, the, the stuff there, one would assume. Um, I'll just leave that there. Windows and G. Really, really easy.